When the ice storm hit southern Ontario during the 2013 holiday season, it caused power outages for half a million electricity customers across the province, including more than 92,000 PowerStream customers. It was a difficult time for customers, as well as for many of our employees, who live in the same communities affected by the ice storm. Being part of the community is one of the reasons we are committed to delivering reliable power to our customers, even under extreme weather conditions. Here are some comments from PowerStream customers and employees on how we weathered the storm together. And the power went off. And it's like you quickly start looking for candles and flashlights. Prepare yourself because you don't know how long it's going to be. You know, this is a big one. You know, you know it's, it's amazing that anybody's got their power at all and that, uh, you know, uh, that it's probably going to be a while before, or potentially could be a long while before we get our power back. It was just looking around and seeing what the, the ice had done to the trees and the circuits. It was, it was pretty unbelievable. It's uh, the worst storm we've uh, ever faced, the biggest impact we've ever had. Uh, really, the extent of tree failure across York Region was uh, something we've never seen. A lot of people were having family come in from out of town, turkeys in the oven, the whole bit, and unfortunately all of that had to be put on hold. The best thing I did was I put myself in their shoes and realized what they were dealing with. I had one customer that I started dealing with on day one. He, he got my name and uh, we communicated probably two or three times a day. PowerStream's Twitter account is what saved us. We knew what was going on constantly. I was shocked that someone at two o'clock in the morning from a corporation would be answering the phone and helping me out. One lady came up to us and asked us when her powers could be back on. And unfortunately, it was backyard construction then, and uh, told the lady that it was going to be at least for sure another day before it powered back on, and uh, she started crying. <laughs> that was tough. We felt their pain. Many of us uh, had no power at home as well, and uh, we wanted to do everything we could to restore the power as quickly as possible. Obviously, the weather and the obstacles uh, to the trees down and everything like that were very difficult to work in, but uh, it's just something that you had to plug through to uh, get the power back on for the community. Um, blazing, blazing snow and ice and everything like that wasn't uh, going to hold everyone back from getting the job done. I felt sorry for those guys out there working long hours in bad weather when they'd rather be home with their families, right? You'd have 80 guys going to one neighborhood and uh, the customer was stressed, cold. Uh, they saw that workforce come in and uh, you know, they definitely uh, brought a smile to their face. We saw power stream employees way up there trying to fix the wires. We were truly working around the clock to get people back on. We had 85% of our customers back on within 48 hours. PowerStream is customer focused and also PowerStream's family pulled together when we needed to support each other and support the customers. Although we weathered the 2013 ice storm together with our customers, we recognize that further improvements in our restoration and communication systems are required when extreme weather conditions causes lengthy or widespread power outages. We intend to do this as part of our continuing efforts as a community-owned energy company to better serve our customers. PowerStream, we weathered the storm together with our customers.